If I would tell you that there's a habit that no one talks about, that is healthy for your mind, that is exciting to do daily, that keeps you going in the right direction, would you like to try? In this video, I'm gonna share my idea that I call the morning check. And I genuinely think that it's so powerful that you change your life and you will love it. My name is Francis Borajski. Nice to have you here. I attended the internet course once about discovering myself. And at the end of the course, I had my values, my strong sides, my best ideas, my goals for the year. It was like a set about me. And I decided that I will revisit this as the first thing in the morning. I did the very simple thing, put them into a folder. So the call to action was to install it deeply in my mind. The task was read it every day, spend with it two minutes per page every day, but I had to check myself for 90 days straight. If I would fall off, I had to start again. 90 days straight. But wait a minute, morning check is not about 90 days. Let me explain. I've never done anything in my life for 90 days straight, but I really wanted to have results. So I created this calendar page for 90 days and I checked myself. So I was really focused to really never fell off. And obviously I fell off. But what happened actually is I started to expand my folder. So for example, I'm reading a book with a very interesting idea and I think, wow, this concept really speaks to me. I want to have it in my life. I've read many books in the past, but most of the essential information are gone. The book has like 300 pages and you remember just the essence in one sentence. You know what four hours work week is all about? about working four hours per week. So why not put it on paper and put it in my folder to revisit it every day again and again and again. So I was adding. Then I discovered new exercise to do daily, like a daily gratitude. Let's add it as well. New habit, okay, I'll just create a new page. So I was adding. I watched an interesting YouTube video and do you know that 66% of what I'm saying right now will be gone from your mind tomorrow morning? 66%. And in one month, it will be 99.9% gone from your mind. If you don't, repeat the information. In the past, I just consumed and I felt that I'm not going anywhere. So right now, when I got interesting idea, concept, I just wanted to have it in my life for a longer time than a few hours, not fleeing from my mind like crazy. Bob Proctor says, repetition is the absolute key. Repetition is the mother of all learning. If you don't use it, you lose it. So I added it in. So from the exercise that took me 10 minutes, it was born. The morning check. The thing, the habit, that is with me to this very day in this very Rembrandt painting folder. Right now it's around 150 pages and about one hour to go, but I absolutely love it. Why I love it? Because it speaks to me, it's deeply mine. There are only thoughts, ideas, concepts that are resonating with me. And moreover, with those ideas I know that I'm on the right track in my development. Those are the most powerful ideas from the most powerful books, from the most powerful people on earth. And I refresh it every, every, every day, beating it deeper in my head, constant. Imagine the most inspiring, the most motivating, the most rewarding book you could read. This is exactly like a short book you write for yourself and you have the habit to read it daily. Isn't that powerful? Come on. Of course, you are saying right now, yeah, but I don't have one hour per day in the morning. Yeah, you don't. So just do five most important pages. Just revisit it whenever you want, even once a week. Refreshing your ideas, goals, exciting thoughts. This is really rewarding and definitely better to do nothing. And what's best about it is actually it flows, it grows. Magic, it's liquid, it's transmutating all the time. It changes naturally with me. As I'm growing, it's growing with me. Some pages I know so well, I read so many months, they're deeply mine, so I don't need them anymore. So I decide to destroy them. And it's enough for me to read some book, watch some YouTube videos, to get new, fresh, interesting pages. So it's evolving. Secondly, best thing is that's 10, 100,000 percent better to start the day with this than with your phone, Instagram, Twitter and all news bullshit. Imagine you start your day and your first hour is just re-exciting yourself, sinking with your most beautiful thoughts. How healthy is that for your mind? Third best thing, this is your second brain. All of your thoughts are now free in your mind, so you don't have to remember them consciously. It's like a Dumbledore's pensive, full of awesome thoughts and the flavor of yourself. So it's not a book to read, because you can change it, you can reshuffle it, refresh it. It's something bigger than journaling, but you can have journal inside of that. 
So this is the morning check, simple yet powerful thing. Having your ideas, goals, quotes that speaks to you, that are deeply yours in one folder and creating the habit of reading them every day as a first thing in the morning. If you would be interested in what's in my morning check, here's the video on this. Thank you so much.